So here is the finished product, the passion fruit vice beer, the wheat beer. Um, it's been bottle conditioning now for just under two weeks. Could use a little bit more. Um, it's not completely uh, carbonated, but it still tastes pretty good. I'm really happy with the flavor. The the um, the alcohol content came out pretty good for the style of beer it's at. So the other thing I wanted to show was um, some labels I had made. You can actually have labels made for your beer. And here, the reason I'm showing so many is these are on all different types of bottles. I just want to see how they fit on different ones. Um, so um, this bottle here is uh, straight tapered, uh, has some um, etching in it that's from Wicked Weed. This is a more standard type bottle. This one is too. It's a little different neck, but pretty standard. It fit both of those perfectly. This one, it fit okay. Just to put this way up high. <clears throat> this one is a little short, longer of a neck. Um, it fit okay here too, except it had to go way down and right to the edge. Um, the ones that didn't fit as well were this one here. This one kind of has a concave thing going on. And you can see it didn't fit great on that because of that. And then um, this is a normal one again. And then over here on this one, um, same thing. It kind of comes down and then back out. And so they don't really fit great for that. So for those, if you're going to go with bot labels and stuff, you may want to, these are rounded. They sell square ones. But anyway, it's from a company out there called Grog Tag. You just go there, grogtag.com. You can upload images. You can do different things. So this is what they send. So here's the necker. And here's the the um, label itself um, goes on pretty easy, a nice little product. And um, that's my name there, Passion of the Vice. I thought it was fitting for a passion fruit vice beer. So anyway, um, I think this is like, you can get like 48 of them for like 30 bucks or something. So it's not cheap, but at the same time, if you want to give them out and things like that, that's kind of cool. You can do as low as 12 of them if you only want to label a few um, and go from there. So anyway, that's it for this beer. And uh, catch the other videos. We've got some other stuff going on right now. Belgian quad still in secondary uh, for a while. IPAs in primary right now. Um, and there'll be other stuff coming very shortly.